I was temporarily backwards, excuse me. What's that supposed to mean, you say? I don't know, man. I'm trying to end this thing. Okay? Don't blame me for it. Blame whoever designed Satanism. <laughs> okay, here we are, the icon of sin. You get started with all your stuff. As we get greeted by a oddly familiar voice. So everyone knows this fact, but that's John Romero speaking backwards. I have to kill him. Because he's the designer of the game. I mean, effectively. For most of the game. Not the whole game, but, you know. Kind of needed John Romero for doing this, to be honest. Anyway. What this thing in the wall does is it spawns monsters at random. Although there's tiers of what's likely to spawn, like an archbile, for instance, would be the least likely thing. And you know, imps and shotgunners would be more common. You know that kind of thing. So the tougher they are, the less likely to spawn. Your goal is to shoot three rockets in his brain. Is that clear? I would. I have a technique for memorizing when to shoot it, and that is to have your rocket sprite to fire just before it covers the Icon of Sin's teeth. I presume that's what the Icon of Sin is. Otherwise the map is just called Icon of Sin, it's not official. Nice. You'll know you've succeeded when you hear him go, Aah! you know. Although I'm pretty sure I heard it briefly when I hit him the first time, too. Don't bother with things behind you, just keep firing. Ooh. Looks like I'm gonna have to try it in the next shot and hope I don't get my ass kicked. But yeah, I would just BFG everything behind me while I get up. And then prepare the rocket for ass blasting. And that's how you do it! Once you got the timing down, you could probably get it down even faster than that. Also, there's something wrong with my kills percentage. That's because there's no monsters to start with, technically. Which means... the kills are gonna be basically 100% times how many monsters that I kill. Besides the boss, which is really more of a texture with code inside. In this case, 17, I believe? Yeah. And no secrets, because why would there be? But I did it under par. Cool. Wasn't thinking about it. I just thought, you know, I had to go fast. The horrendous visage of the biggest demon you've ever seen crumbles before you after you pump your rockets into his exposed brain. The monster shrivels up and dies, its thrashing limbs devastating untold miles of hell's surface. You've done it. The invasion is over. Earth is saved. Hell is a wreck. You wonder where bad folks will go when they die now. Wiping the sweat from your forehead, you begin the long trek back home. Rebuilding Earth ought to be a lot more fun than ruining it was. Be more constructive. Be like Denmark and its Legos. Be like Sweden and its Minecrafts. Here's the cast of characters. We all know them. Zombie Man! Shotgun Guy! Do the Doom Pokemon rap! Uh, yeah. So I want to tell you, I had a great time playing this. And towards the end of it, I actually got more of my time figured out and this game in general. And that means I would I play more Doom? Yeah, actually, I have at least four major wads that I would want four major level packs I want to actually do. You probably know two of them. The other two maybe not so much. 
And then beyond that, yeah, every so often, just do more Doom. Let's not poison the well with constant amounts of Doom, Mario, but I can do that, so, you know, it's not... It's not something I want to keep doing, because, you know, I like playing other games sometimes. Yeah. And I don't know why we're doing the Wolfenstein 3D music at the end. That's kind of weird. But we did it. The Pain Elemental doesn't technically have an attack. It's just the summoning. I know, because it's going through the monster's attacks. I have pressed the uh, space bar to move it along. See, there I knew it had to, like, fire three times in a row first. Oh, look at them death sprites. Let's remember the archbile. Pro I would, if I gave him a personality, be like the star scream of the Doom Demons. Or like the equivalent of, you know, the second Terminator in Terminator 2. Because he's just that much of an asshole. Wow, the cyber demon. Truly, he was better than the other. And our hero! No official name! It's John Doom Space Marine Man. Yeah, that's it. So, next time, a new project. Uh, yeah. See you later.